Before we start this video, we encourage you to please like, share and subscribe to the channel because it's your support. Yes, your support that the channel needs to grow. Please like, share and subscribe. Hi, welcome to another video. This video is about a special multiplication trick. This trick is used when we have to multiply two numbers and the last digits of the two numbers add up to 10 and the other digits of the two numbers are the same. For example, we have to multiply 74 by 76. Now we can observe that 7 is common in both the numbers and the last digits 4 and 6 add up to 10. So what we can do now is we can multiply 7 by its immediate successor that is 7 multiplied by 8. This gives us the first part of the answer that is 56. The second part of the answer is just 4 multiplied by 6 that is 24. So, 74 multiplied by 76 is 5, 6, 2, 4. That's it. Now, if we have to multiply 102 by 108, then we observe that 10 is common in both the numbers and 2 and 8 add up to 10. So, we simply multiply 10 by its successor 11 to get the first part of the answer which is 110 and to get the second part of the answer we simply multiply 2 by 8 which is 16 and the answer of 102 multiplied by 108 is 11016 that's it it's that easy guys but there is a caution there is a special case involved Suppose you have to multiply 61 by 69. Now, you can easily observe that 6 is same in both the numbers and 1 and 9 add up to 10. So, 6 multiplied by 7 to get the first part of the answer, 42 and 1 multiplied by 9 to get the second part of the answer, that will be 9. No. If you write 9, you will be making a mistake. You have to write 0, 9 because the second part of the answer always has two digits. Okay? The second part of the answer always has two digits. So, you will have to write 0, 9 instead of 9. So, the answer of 61 multiplied by 69 will be 4209. If you write 429, it will be wrong. 4209, remember, two digits. So, if you think there is only one special case scenario, 1 multiplied by 9 or 9 multiplied by 1 is equal to 9. Only in this case, you need to use 0, 9 because in each and every other case where the last two digits can add up to 10, you will get a double digit number automatically. 2 into 8 or 8 into 2 is 16. 3 into 7 or 7 into 3 is 21. 4 into 6 or 6 into 4 is equal to 24. And 5 multiplied by 5 is equal to 5 multiplied by 5 and that's 25. So, there is only one special case scenario where there is 1 and 9 at the end of digits of the two numbers. 
so guys now i'm giving you some questions to practice and i hope that you will be able to solve them within seconds like my channel share my videos as much as possible and subscribe to my channel because it's your support that helps us to grow